और किसी देव यालुक ने आत्मा को सौंप एस माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एस इस एक्सप्रेशन प्रोग्राम डेट इस यूज्ड टू रिकॉर्ड एंड एनालाइज मेरिका डेटा माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एसएल इस एक्सप्रेशन प्रोग्राम डेट इस यूज्ड टू रिकॉर्ड एंड एनालाइज मेरिका डेटा व्हेन वी से स्प्रेशन स्प्रेशन इस ए कलेक्शन ऑफ रूल्स एंड कॉलम स्प्रेशन इस ए कलेक्शन ऑफ रूल्स एंड कॉलम सो इन एसएल डेटा इस ऑर्गेनाइज्ड इन फॉर्म्स ऑफ रूल्स एंड कॉलम्स and when you open Microsoft of uh, Excel, the alphabet are called columns, as I'm ha I've highlighted here. They are columns, and then numbers are called rules. So in all special software, there's rules, there's columns which are the alphabet, and then the corresponding rules. So in Excel, data is organized in forms of rules and columns. And then the intersection of rows and columns is called cell. A cell is the intersection of the row and the column, or what you see here as boxes. They are called cells. That's a cell. A cell is the intersection of rows and columns. So cells are named according to their rows and respective rows and columns. So what we have there is A, the column is A, and then the row is what? 1. So we have A1. So this cell is called cell A1 because the corresponding row, uh, column is what? A, and then the row is what? 1. So when we come here, we we'll get B1 because the column is what? B, and then the row is what? Number 1 in that order. When we come down to... Uh, a, the column is A, the row is what? 2. So cells are the intersection of rows and columns. And then data in Excel is organized in the form of rows and columns. Rows are the vertical layout and then the columns are the alphabet, uh, are the horizontal. So Excel is a special software for data analysis. And the data in Excel is organized in forms of rows and columns. Okay, all SF files must be saved in .xls or .slx if you are using a higher version. So you see we have here book 1. We have uh, the name of the file I'm saving here is uh, sys analysis sys. The next, the format is what .xlsx. If you are using below uh, from uh, 1998. To 2007, you see XLS, but from 27, uh, 2007 upwards, you see the X added as an extension. The X means extended. Okay, so I'll save my work. Control S is in all Microsoft packages. Control S is for saving. I click save. You see that the title of the work is what? Says. And these are what we call the top menus. View, review, data, formulas. Page layout are called the main menus or the top menus. The main menus. Then we have the formatting bar. The formatting bar has the cut, copy, format, the font style chooser, font chooser, then the font size chooser. They are all made up for the formatting. And when we say formatting, we refer to what? Changing the appearance of a text or the, the a data, changing the appearance. So when you want to change the appearance, like let's say you want to bold this, you select all these. And go to the formatting bar and you, you click on B or you use the keyboard shortcut control if you are using Macintosh command B if you are using Windows control B control B or command B will boot all this for us let me increase the workspace so we have Let's look at a, a workbook. An Excel file is called a workbook. An Excel file is called a workbook. An Excel file is called a workbook. So when I ask you what is a workbook, you should be able to tell me. An Excel file 
is called a workbook. So any Excel document you copy is a workbook. And then we call something sheet one and two. Uh, then these are technologies you must learn in Excel. Workspace. Uh, a collection uh, so these are technologies and we say rules are a numerical and vertical and columns are the alphabetical so when you see a uh, we said excel is made up of rows and columns and an excel file is called a workbook okay so let's come back to our board so these are the the alphabet are what we call the rows, and then the numbers are what we, uh, the alphabet are what we call the columns. A, B, C, D are called columns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight are called rows. Fine. So let's create a sample Excel work. You create an, you open your Excel, you go to New, or you can use the command Control End. If you are using Macintosh, you use Command End. And so command and I open. So I have a metric uh, series. Metric. We say Excel is used for my, uh, data analysis. So we are analyzing the series of uh, Madame Reynolds. Uh, 